it's day two, and uh, it's really cold. It's like really, really cold. I think it's like 20 something degrees today, and uh, it's not easy. We just got here, and we we're gonna go to a coffee shop, and we're gonna have a short interview with Kim Farong. She is the director of Stranger Land, the movie I saw yesterday with Nicole Kidman. And uh, she's gonna give us like 10 minutes, and we're gonna have a nice chat about the movie. And uh, it should be really fun. So we're headed towards that now. And oh my god, it's so cold. It was a short interview, about 10 minutes, but it was a really special interview. I got to ask her a lot of in depth questions about the movie and the characters and what it meant for her. And she teared up a little bit. It was a very special moment. And it was, it was just one of those that you're never going to forget. She was so lovely. She was so caring about what she's done and how people are reacting to her movie. And uh, so far, one of the best moments in some days. I just made it out of Chloro, and uh, it's an Italian movie about this girl who wants to be a synchronized swimmer, but uh, tragedy strikes the family, so she has to move to a place where there is no pools or anything. And uh, it's a touching story. It's a little long. Uh, not long, it's a little slow. But uh, I really liked it. It was pretty good. And now I'm gonna go meet the guys at this other red carpet thing. It's uh, for I Am Michael, the new James Franco movie. So I'm gonna find the bus to get there. I hope it won't be late. Sorry for ending the vlog abruptly, like I know I didn't get a lot of footage right there in the end. It's because we weren't able to get into the movie per se, but we already knew we weren't going to do that. So we were just trying to like relax and have a good time and get some dinner because we were really hungry. And uh, we just walked around a lot on Main Street uh, in Park City and we discovered like a few art galleries and some places to eat. We had like awesome pasta that I totally forgot to film it. I'm so sorry. But it was like chicken fettuccine alfredo and it was delicious. Like it really hit the spot after a long day and uh, it was kind of a relaxed day. I very much enjoyed it and now we're back at uh, Steven's house and it's his birthday so there's like some music going on outside. We're gonna go hang out for a little bit and then I'm going to hit the sack because I'm 
really tired and thankfully tomorrow the morning will be very slow. So we got some time to like, you know, write a few things and maybe I'll edit some vlogs and you guys can get to see something. But yeah, that's for today, you know, day two of Sundance. I hope you enjoyed it. I know it wasn't a lot, um, but there will be more to come. So get ready for day three and uh, I'll see you on the next one. Bye!